Hi and welcome to our introduction to our new G-Series cameras, both the GF3 and the G3. Now I've managed to pull aside Ken Duncan to have a bit of a chat with us and go through the G-Series system. How are you Ken? Good mate, good. Good to be here. Uh, well, these are serious cameras. I love these little cameras. I've used some of the G-Series cameras. What I love about them is the size. Like, look at that. That is a serious <laughs> camera that size. I mean, you can just stick it in your pocket, which I will. No way. <laughs> and the thing is, you can do, you know, full 1080p, high resolution, high definition footage on that. So you can do movie footage or you can do some beautiful shots. What, it, being so small allows you to get shots that you normally couldn't do with a, a SLR. Because these days, as soon as you pull out a big camera, people start looking at you and wondering what you're doing and sometimes shutting you down because you're not allowed to take a photo here, you're not, not allowed to take a photo here or wherever. But you pull these things out and just go click, click, grab the shot <laughs> and you can get the shot. What makes them so great, the G-Series, is they have all the advantages of an SLR and that you see what you're, you're getting through the lens. But you don't have that stupid mirror because that <laughs> mirror, man, is like clunkety, clunkety, clunkety going up and down like this. And that creates one of the biggest issues, which is uh, mirror shake. Uh, so when you're doing slow exposures, if you have a mirror, mm. you're not going to be able to do the slow exposures that this thing can get away with because it doesn't have that mirror. Also, when you're using, for example, long lenses for shooting wildlife, you don't have to deal with that mirror shake again because it doesn't have the mirror. So it allows you to get shots that you can't get with a camera that has mirrors. So, you know, these are not just a little toy camera. These are the serious camera, the G-series cameras. Fantastic. They're good cameras. Yeah, they certainly are. So what we're going to do is we're going to go through some of the more uh, intricate details for the GF3 and the G3 as well. And thanks for your time, Ken. My pleasure, mate. Okay.